Right now, I'm gonna show you how to remove these sliding doors. It's actually very easy, and all you need is a screwdriver. So first here, the door is actually hung on a track up here. As you can see, there are two fasteners, one on the left side and one on the right side that you can't really see, but it is down there. And then it's got this wheel in place that rolls back and forth on the track. Now you can't just lift it up and pull it out, you actually have to tilt it at an angle. So I'm going to show you how to do that. At the bottom you can see here that's the component that keeps it in place. All you need to do is remove it with a screwdriver. There is a screw in the front here and a screw in the back. Once you remove both of the screws, you then need to slide this out of the way so that you can then actually move the door out a little bit. So we're going to keep this in place so that we'll be able to remember where it goes. But now let's go ahead and remove the doors. So I'll just set this aside in a safe place so that when I'm done with the doors, whatever you're doing with the doors, you can go ahead and put them back into place. So here, I just want to get on each side of it. I'm going to tilt it out at an angle and then just lift up. And at that point, ah, the wheels will come out and you've got the door off the track. Doesn't take that long, it's not that hard. These doors I'm actually going to paint, so I'm going to remove the basically the fasteners there and then paint the door. Whatever you're doing it for, go ahead and do that. Do what your plans are, then you can hang them back the same way. You're going to then attach everything back. You'll have to get it in at an angle, come up, pull it back towards you, once it's in, you can let it swing back and then it'll kind of fall into place there. And there you go, you are back in business. So there you go, that is how you remove the door on your sliding closet doors. If you like DIY around the house stuff, please feel free to like and subscribe. My name is Drew, I'll see you in the next one.